Hello, my name is Victoria Vidal, and today I will be reading the poem Welcome to America by Sarah Abu Rashad. I would recommend this poem for audiences um, of the high school age group from 14 to 18, um, and maybe some advanced students in the eighth grade. Bring us your oppressed, your exhausted bodies, your hungry, unheard crowds, and we shall set them free. I'd like you to welcome you to the one and only, the greatest America, says the lady in the white shirt behind a desk. Now, honey, please fill out these papers and don't forget to send us your story. Why you came here, your hopes and expectations, we wish you a happy life. Sixteen springs I've witnessed, not one was blooming there behind the shores of the Mediterranean. Everything is a martyr. There we don't dare lift, live lest we die. Even roses grow stripped of colors. Though the scarred walls there memorize our names through the tarred rows, there know our stories. But here, to every alley, there, to every town, I must introduce myself. No, no, I am sorry. I am not who you think I am. No, I am not who they say I am. See, I am as much of human, I am as much of a human as you are. I brush my teeth. I sleep. I cry when hurt and bleed when injured. I walk the land you walk, I breathe the same air you breathe. Your American dream is my dream. I am afraid of what you're afraid of. Please don't stop me on the streets to ask what jihad is. Don't mistake me for one of them. Don't stare at me like an alien, like a one-eyed, four-legged, green monster of your nightmares. I am a woman of faith, a citizen, not a suspect. I carry a breaking heart within. I hold mics, not guns. My story refuses to be told in bullets and word limits. And no, I don't celebrate the death of children. I don't wish to destroy homes and churches. Trust me, I know what loss smells like. The way fear and revolution play tug of war on doorsteps, uproot loved ones from framed pictures on walls, steal a father from the dinner table. I can only hope mine hears me now. I know what loss smells like from a mile afar, the way friends tell you they saw your house tear asunder like it was never there. The old gate, the dolls, grandma's garden, and every dream we've built on the roof with hands too small to plant hatred. Still, some fear me. They call me names. They try to break me, to wreck me, to ricochet me. But my spine will keep mountains standing. My knees will only ever kneel to my Lord. Lord, make us whole again, all of us. Make us human again. Forgive us for we have sinned, and Lord, guide them to see me for who I am, because I too yearn for peace, because I drop poems, not bombs. Thank you.